It feels super smooth back here, bro. If it wasn't loud, it's like we're driving a stock Mustang. fam hold this message finds you all well in great spirits well well yes we are back from california we're back home in jersey but the grind doesn't stop i'm so excited i came home to an amazing gift at the door that that's right we got our drag brakes that came in so excited we're gonna take them to casper's because the mamba's not here right now she's over at casper's right now they're getting oil chains getting the front coilers put in they're gonna have to put these brakes in now see i'm still eagle beast here i got the fusion Eco boost. Oh. And look at this. 137,000 miles going strong. The build of the Mamba continues. And one of the things that we were waiting on was our drag brakes. Now, these came highly recommended from Steeda, who has the fastest NA uh, 2018 Mustang and up in the country at 10.30s or 10.20s maybe by this point. I was told by uh, Bob Adams, who's the head of Steeda Vehicles, he said, listen, those um, performance pack brakes are great for the application of track autocross use, but for straight line performance, they're more or less boat anchors. Those are his exact words. Uh, and like I said, unfortunately, if you guys wanted those, those the stock ones are already sold. Uh, so we're going to head to Casper's now. We're going to get these on. We're going to weigh the car after they're installed. Uh, and we're going to see how the car drives. Um, we're going to talk and walk through the process of that. All right. There's the Mamba. I haven't seen her. There she is. About to get her drag brakes. Front rear. It's back like some narcotics. Bot in the truck is Oh. They're the same size. They're the same size. All the way around. All right. Well, that's a nice looking piece, dude. Yeah. Uh, that's your tire. Can't get the mods with the rolling air pressure. saying goodbye to these brakes right here. Now we're gonna say hello to these. Well, that's right, these do have the brand new Steeda front co coilovers are on. These awesome ramps, they're made out of cardboard, they still do the job. I love, I love it. But here it is, guys the drag brakes, the bare drag brakes are laid out. Front coilovers are on there from Steeda. 125 pound springs. And we're saying goodbye to the performance pack brakes. I can't wait to see the car with these on. Oh, uh, dude, the color's sick. The color Big is. shout out to Mason coming in on a Saturday on his day off to do this, by the way. Appreciate it. Oh. Goodness gracious. Bro, you're going to be going down a road. It's going to be flipping. It's going to just look, yeah, look like right? it's like. So you bought a brand new Rolex. I know. Yeah, it's right, right, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't wait. Can't wait. It's good to drive the media cars, but it's nothing like your own, I tell you what. We got our tattoo here. Our dumps still doing a great job. Custom from our buddies at Casper's. Look at all this. Woo. I know I should take this off, but I just look at it as a badge of honor. Ah. It's bad. Yeah. 
it's free. Oh, is, is it? It's in, the wheel. it's in the wheel, yeah. These are huge. Now I'm looking at them like, God. Oh, God they're they're huge. Yeah. See that small foil? They look so tiny. <laughs> Love it. These are square lines. Gotcha. I'm hoping that they're gonna work. That's my first thing I'm gonna do. We'll take one line off. We're gonna see if it bolts up to there. Make sure it don't leak or nothing. We'll do one side. If anything, we can always go back. Yeah. You know what I mean? And if you have to, call Bear and we'll get stainless lines. Sure. Set. But I wanna make sure that they fit first. Which they should. They should. I don't see a problem or not. I think these are a front. Wide. Yeah, these are fronts. I mean, it's in the same location. As long as the banjo is the same size, the line and the washer fills that nice gap, and we have to put the square line on it, and it don't cock. We should be all right. I like having a ledge because why they do this is when you tighten this, the line wants to turn. Mm -hmm. So they put the ledge here so the line can't turn. So I'm just gonna have to hold the line and try and get it straight and get it as tight as I can. But if it seems like it's not going to work, we're going to stop. Okay. And just, you know what I mean? See what, Be safe and sorry. If they want to run their stainless line, which you shouldn't have to. Now, <coughs> let's talk about something. You want to go curling? You're probably going to be able to hold it like that. Holy you cow. You want to go curling? <laughs> this is heavy. You know? Oh, wow. This is different. That's amazing. And I got to so when you wheel. off camera, it's great. Whenever you need brakes, you always keep the hubs unless the hub gets damaged. Yeah. You just rip the bolts out, they send you a new rotor, slap it on. Good to roll. You know what I mean? <laughs> that looks so good. It looks very good. Well, tight. we're done. <laughs> yeah, that's it. We're done. <laughs> Go to See, it's not even my car now, so. At this point, it basically is. Yeah. You've done enough work on it. I'm like, stoked for these. Shout out to Mason. If He's a man, Mamba master mechanic, so if you guys did anything, not just for S550, but... Name it. V6 yeah. Mustang. He's done everything, yep. Hey, I done yours. He did the EcoBoost. He did, did the EcoBoost, too, yeah, so... I didn't even know it was you. Yeah. And no clue. Oh, yeah, 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 you this, did a great job back then, guys too. The, shit, that was... Three years ago. That was the first new gen I ever pulled the, yeah. pulled the front end off. Now I take the front end off Usually like... Five minutes, yeah. Very tiny. I'll tell you what, they did an amazing job on that. Um, the color. The color looks amazing. I mean, yeah. It's monster green, they call it. Anodized, too. I'm almost positive they anodized these. Yeah, it's too smooth. Yeah. Man, fill so it. So normally fill it, they anodize, fill it a little bit. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. She looks good already. Just looking oh, at you God. hold it there. Oh, I can't wait. Alright, there it is. Oh man. Mama looks killer! Look at these, bro. Oh. So good. These are the old bricks for comparison. You can see the size, the weight. This is rotating weight that we're, we're losing. So she's gonna be moving out. Let's go. Remember, we guys get the extended studs, so yeah, they always kind of taper in a little yeah. bit. When you tighten the wheel, it straightens it back out. So. These are gorgeous, dude. Look at how they milled it for the bolt. Mm. That's incredible. That's incredible. It really does. Right it looks there. like jewelry. It does. Like. It really does.
You see how clear the car looks with the coilovers, the brakes, the hood. The Dude, hood. Just look at the front. Like, and it. Dude, oh, sure. Looks so good. Dude, you, you literally have the best Mustang out there. You bought it, beat the balls out of this car. <laughs> I mean, beat the balls out of this car. And she likes it. And she loves it. And she, she likes, she likes, you know. But it's, it's, she's holding, that's a testament to the. Now, to, don't, get me, don't get wrong. Ever since you, I've done how many of these? Yeah. Joe's car, Jordan's car. Uh, I mean, you name what we got. Them. Don't yeah. get me wrong. I love Joe's car. Gorgeous. This car is gorgeous. I love the whip. I love how much power it makes. I love it. I'd rather have this stuff. Yeah. Because you jump in this, you roll, man. You're yeah. killing it. You know what I mean? Like you. It's, use, it's usable track. power. A lot of powers you can't going, use on the street. You're going track to track. You're driving to Detroit. You're driving it every day, daily. Well, I'm bleeding the lines now. Now we're just going to do the brake bleed process. So we'll wait for him to tell us to pump it, hold it, pump it, hold it. Passenger front, driver's front. The farthest one away from the master zone, you always do first. Okay. Alright. Very nice. Hope this helps. So pump for a hold, pump for a hold, pump for a hold, pump for a hold. No funny comments, please. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Holding. Pump it up. Holding. Again. Holding. All right, what's, what we got done here? Oh, <laughs> uh, well, that? since, uh, you know, we had to modify a couple things. Just so you guys know, if you ever do these, you can use your stock lines mm -hmm. and the brackets. Just flip them down and rotate them back some, and you just bolt them on upside down. And they'll hold the line, because normally the line will come straight down and go over. Now you need to go over and over. So it makes a nice flow, and the wheel goes up, and it ain't going to bind, ain't going to hit nothing, you ain't going to lose brakes. And then since we eliminated the e-brakes, you literally just tuck the cables up in the up 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 here to where you can't see them anymore. Mm -hmm. If you follow the cable there, you'll see it going around. Um, and you gotta mount the ABS wire. So just get a clamp and mount the ABS wire. That's about it. On the backs, in the front, and be it simple. The lines literally go right on the factory. Right in the factory locations. So sweet, looks so clean. All right, cool. and then we'll, we'll eventually have the car back at the strip with the drag pack on. But for now, we're headed to Cars and Coffee, so uh, Macy's making it stock for us. Yeah. All right, so we're done, and uh, if you stay this long in the video, here's the secret sauce. That's right. A lot of people wonder what and why the mama doesn't tick like crazy. Is we use 5W30, uh, 11 quarts, not 10. And we put a uh, Ceratec Liquid Molly. Make sure you get that box. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of people say put two. I put one, and then I put two later. That's the second one later. This is just my weird formula. You got to follow your own. Uh, this this you. is what's worked for me. Yeah. So. A weird color. It is a crazy weird color, but it just coats everything nicely. Again, Royal Purple, Purple, not Purple, 5W30. You can use two of those, but I just use one and I use another one as we get near the end because there is 11 quarts in there. Oh, look, you can screw it in. Yeah. Stock, it calls for 10W20 uh, at 10 quarts, but I put 10W30, 11 quarts, and then I add the Saratech. That's my formula. So that's what's kept Mamba running. There you go. What are we doing about the breed now? I had she didn't hit me back up yet, so we can keep it as is. Huh. I think it rides great. With All right, let's right, let's ride it as is. Yeah. All we got left is is to finish up the uh, video with the driving review, and we'll do that next. But first, we'll see how she sounds in the light. How she sounds in the seal uh, backing up in the light.
right, finally. Nice. Alright, we're going to take a little test drive. I told you the pedal is going to be so far hot. Dude. Oh yeah? Oh my god, it's really different. What we're burn a bit yet. You want to jump in? Should I jump in? Alright, let's jump in. Got my seat here. Yeah. <laughs> ah. Right. We got part of this Yep. Alright, cool. and everything done it's too it's super smooth back here smell them? yeah i do smell it i can smell them out of them. yeah i do smell it yep i'll tell you what dude the pedals i'm barely touching them well <laughs> i'm glad because i going down at the end of this trip i was getting kind of sketch at the end <laughs> it back here i was like what is this I'm we pulling like, g's already <laughs> dude, i'm like not even really hitting it that hard either i can't believe i've been this far up i can't get over how it feels like we're in a cadillac right now bro and I, i'm sitting in the back seat here <laughs> and uh it's crazy these neighbors hate you, by the way. <laughs> Every time I ever test your car. Oh, <laughs> nice. Still got our seatbelt on. So we're fine back here. Use the front brakes.
Dude, I can feel it back here. It's stopping like crazy good. Yeah, yeah. Breaking it in properly. So how they feel to you, brother? Oh, they feel great. Like way better than stock. I'll tell you that. And they're yeah. smaller too. It's crazy. Oh yeah. How's the car feel? Like you just you, know, you drove it before and afterwards. Oh yeah. Coilovers, well, drag brakes. I was a worried doing the coilovers. I'm like, dude. When I was looking at them, I'm like, this car's gonna ride like crap. Yeah, yeah. Terrible. And I put them in there. We you know we trust them all the way down so we can keep the ride height and the rebound's still kind of in the middle. Yeah. And dude, it rides even better than it did with the other one. I'm telling you from back here, zero vibration. And oh, zero. vibrations are nuts. I mean, we're on the stock wheels now. Yeah. But even with the skinnies in the front, there was nothing. Wait till we have the drag pack on. How's it look? Everything looks good to you? Yeah, I'm making sure. You see the marks on the rotors? Yeah. So, if you had a caliper that's like hanging, you would yeah. see it. One yeah, side exactly. would be hotter than the other. This yeah. matches that side. So, see how we broke it in a little bit? See how shiny now? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, it's still not fully in. Yeah. Because the pad's going to ride the whole thing. So, the more you drive it, the more exactly. it's going to get That's in. what we're going to Cars we and Coffee tomorrow. We got the face breaking in there, kind of. Yep. I didn't want to put you through the windshield. No, I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah. Oh, it's coming together. <laughs> hey, man, I want to say thanks again to my dude here, Mason. The master mama mechanic came through, did this on his day off on a Saturday, was so kind, killed it, was quick about it. And let me tell you something right now. We're not kidding. This car drives so smooth. I'm going to drive the cars and coffee an hour and a half away tonight. So yeah, we'll be like, there tomorrow. It rides better than a stock Mustang. Dude, I think. usually with all suspension upgrades, oh, it's yeah. it's not it's not worth it. No. We're on what? Drag springs. Drag, drag springs. Shocks, drag shock. Front coilovers. Camber axles. Plates. Camber plates. I mean the whole nine, and it's smooth. Oh yeah. Dude. Got a converter in it. Got a converter. Got a diff in it. Thanks for this guy, What's Caspers. Appreciate you. Thanks again. You know what we say? Never ends. Peace. <laughs>